absolutely beautiful sight. Check out those Brontos in my fort over there in the distance as the sun comes up over the horizon. Oh man, that just looks so cool. I love the graphics of this game. Welcome everybody. Welcome to a new day in ARC. Love the sound of that music. In the wee hours of the morning. Today is a special day, ladies and gentlemen. Today is the culmination of much preparation. Uh, a phenomenal amount of effort and time has gone into setting this up. And uh, you may be wondering, um, you're not in your base. Where are you? Well, um, I made a little platform <laughs> right here by the Giga. I am, I think I'm way over preparing for this, but I, I don't know what to expect. I know he does in a phenomenal amount of damage. Oh, there's a Dodo right there. Is that Dodo going to get eaten? How is that Dodo? I mean, I guess he's not seeing it because of the walls. I mean, that's that's literally a chicken nugget walking on the beach. <laughs> but anyways, guys, welcome to another episode of Ark Survival. I am so excited today. Today means a lot. Um, there has been a phenomenal amount of preparation, time, work, effort, stuff on stream, stuff off screen. Uh, and this is an example of stuff off screen. So let me let me yeah, let me do this I was I was just gonna climb down, but let me let me do this And just show you kind of what I made here. I made a little hunting perch if you will uh, Because I was setting up to get this um, earlier uh, yesterday and uh, I started getting attacked by a bunch of saber tooths that spawned. I'm like, I can't, I can't have this to where I'm hunting or trying to tranquilize this guy. And all of a sudden, like some raptors or some saber tooths or something come along and just totally screw everything up for me. So I made this little hunting platform. I uh, went and got some more metal because I wanted it to not be able to be uh, uh, destroyed in case somehow, A, I have a feeling he's going to glitch out. Um, I have, I, I, I don't know that for sure, but I think he, oh, whew, I should have put a railing there. Um, so, but anyways, guys, I am, uh, I'm ready. Um, I've got, let me give you a tour of what I got. I got a smithy. I thought about it and I'm like, what if I'm like halfway done, like tranquilizing him? And I heard it takes a phenomenal, a phenomenal amount of tranquilizer arrows. So I've got like 600, but I'm like, I started thinking about it. And I'm like, I don't, I don't think my crossbow can handle shooting 600 before it breaks. Um, so I brought a smithy. I brought um, an extra set of armor and a bunch of supplies and a lower level crossbow in worst case scenario and a lower level rifle with a dart already in it in worst case scenario. I've got, uh, as you can see, a ton of narcotics. And uh, yeah, guys, I think this is it. I'm excited. I'm nervous. I brought, I brought this in case I need to make something in the i just i'm way <laughs> way over preparing and just guys just take a look at that that is just that is just so cool that is just so nice oh can't wait so anyways guys um i think this is it i think we're gonna get started um what i have i ended up crafting more kibble I said to myself, is 24 kibble really going to be enough for this gigantic? I don't know. So I went ahead and spent the time. And, uh, oh, I need to eat. Um, uh, 
and created some more. I also brought some stew in case I need to regen my stamina for whatever reason. I've got my medical brew. I got a lesser antidote in case I get some sort of anything. And um, I got my darts and some ammunition. So I've got my better armor on. So I think we're ready to go, guys. What do you say? So we start this? Okay. Nervous. You know what? Save the game. Save the game. All right, guys. Whew. What? Oh, I'm burning up. Okay, that's all right. Um, you know what? For right now, let's see. Uh, why don't I take that off? Here, that did it. Okay. All right, the heat went down. All right, guys, here's my fear. My fear is that he's glitch and is that he's going to get out. If he gets out, I'm going to jump on freedom and I'm going to try to lead him away from the base and try to just get him to start eating the dinos that are down over there and then regroup, try to get this open again and then try to get him back into the trap. So that's my plan. What do you guys think? Leave me a comment below. Did I plan correctly? Did I overplan? Is this too much? I was thinking about maybe staying up here. Can I like, yeah, a little bit better. All right, guys, here we go. And in three, two, one. Here we go. Oh boy. Oh, he's... Oh, I see a mistake. He's, uh... He's tearing into the stone foundations. I completely forgot to replace the stone foundations. And... Oh, man. I don't know if this is gonna hold up. Guys, so much work, and I, re I realized I didn't replace the stone foundations with metal ones. Oh my goodness. And I think the walls will not stay. A colossal mistake. Shoot. Oh, he stopped. He stopped. I don't know what just happened, but he stopped chewing on the foundations. I don't think he can lean. Oh, there he goes again. Not good. Oh my goodness, this is gonna take a long time. If I should quickly go grab some metal foundations. But then that means I would have to start over and his torpidity will start going down. Oh! Oh, please don't glitch. It's like he... Oh, he's chewing on him again. He's trying to get out of the trap. Oh, I wish this thing would fire faster. 
Alright guys, I am getting to about the 75 arrow, there's 75 right there, and I am 30,000 of 84, 30, 60, 90, okay, I should have enough then. see one of the foundations is missing and the wall did not collapse so I'm being I'm hopeful I'm being really hopeful right now that that wall hangs tight ah, guys I am just spamming the fire button I wonder if I can get some headshots better. Now, somebody sent me a private message stating that if I am able to get it down, to have a hundred narcotics ready to go immediately and to feed him a hundred right away. Okay, looks like I am now at 50% torpidity. I'm halfway there, guys. I hope that my mistake is not going to cost me. Yep, I see the foundation pieces missing, but the wall is holding. The wall is holding. Oh, there he goes again. Guys, my heart is racing right now. I am, like, so nervous for this right now. Oh, my goodness. All right, I have fired. We're coming up to 125 with that one right there. 125 arrows. Every once in a while, he just stops. My gosh, this is phenomenally difficult with torpidity. That torpidity is fighting me too. Every once in a while I see it just dip. I think I do anyways, either that or I'm looking at it wrong. Oh, come on. Come on, come on, baby. Getting headshots and the numbers for hit point damage is not changing. Okay, he's gotten mad again. Okay, 24,000 more torpedo to go. Okay, my crossbow is reaching 50%, so I think I'm okay. I should have put that other crossbow in my inventory, but I do have my rifle, and I have 200 darts. Um, I don't know at this point, to be honest, guys, is the crossbow better with arrows, or is the rifle better with arrows? I know the crossbow does more damage. Man, oh man. I'm actually surprised that he's showing bloody a little bit. Oh, please don't glitch. No, 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 please don't glitch. He keeps trying to walk. One thing I did forget to do that I was going to do is put down bear traps. Oh my gosh, he's trying to glitch through the wall. Please don't glitch. We're almost there, guys. 14,000 more. My finger is getting a workout right now. Okay, we are coming up on 200 darts here soon.
Please don't glitch. So much has gone to this, so much preparation. Come on. All right. Come on. No, please stop walking. Stop walking. I'm so worried he's gonna glitch through that wall. Oh look, he's almost through. So many steps, he's almost through. I'm so nervous he's gonna glitch through that wall. All right, 4,000 more torpor. Just 4,000 more, we're almost there. We're almost there. Come on, no, 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 stop walking. Stop walking. I almost think I heard a raptor. There he is. Yes. Yes. All right. He's down. Now, um, I need take, take, take. And I've got my kibble. All right. He's down, guys. He is down. He is down. He is down. Now, I was told to immediately feed him uh, 100 narcotics. Oops. And just feed him 100 narcotics to keep him knocked out. And I'm going to put some kibble in there. And I have got to keep an eye on his torpidity. Because that's going to be my biggest challenge, is keeping that torpidity low. I wonder if I should go ahead and try to feed him a kibble. I don't know if that works the way I think it works. He is out cold, guys. Look at this monster. Holy, I never thought I would get to this point. This is phenomenal. Okay, let me put this away so I don't accidentally shoot him. Taming effectiveness right now is at a hundred percent. His food is slowly going down. Let me get some more narcotics in the inventory slot. Oh, look at that damage. Um, let me get another. Let's get those in there. And if his torpidity starts going down, I am going to start feeding him another hundred narcotics. So at this point, guys, it's a waiting game. So, uh, yeah, I'm just going to keep standing by, keep watch, stay alert, and uh, we'll be right back. Guys, we're here. We've done it. Yes. Yes, we've done it. Oh, man. And, and I've, I've got a problem. I don't know what to name her. Oh my goodness. All right, guys, you've been on this ride with me. You've been on this journey with me. I want to hear from you. Leave me in comments down below. What should I name this level 125? Well, actually, it's not level 125 anymore. Uh, 187 giga. Oh my God. I, I just, I, I don't have the words right now. Look at the size of this thing. I'm like, oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. And it's colors or her colors are so awesome. That is just, um, I, I don't have the words, guys. Guys, I don't have the words. Oh, I can finally come in here and take a look at the damage she did. She, she only knocked out one block. Oh, thank goodness. That, w the metal walls weren't getting hit at all. 1800 oh my goodness all right 
All right, Giga. Giga to be named. Can you follow me this way? Or are you still stuck? She's still stuck. She's. I think she's actually stuck in the wall. All right, let's fix this. Let's fix this. And she's three walls thick. She's a thick girl. Woo. <laughs> Guys. Oh my god. All right. Um, I, I hope the rest of my, uh, <laughs> I hope the rest of my, uh, dinos are ready for this. Oh, I, 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 there's such a feeling of elation right now, guys. Oh, I, I I'm just, I, I don't have the words. She is so fat. I'm, I'm stuck in her mouth. Okay. Whew. Oh, she's so fast. Oh, I'm going to be able to get her to my main base in no time. Oh my goodness, guys. I just don't have the words right now, man. I, I, I don't know what to say. <sighs> All right, guys. Well, listen, um, I'm going to get started in making her her saddle. Oh, my goodness. All right, guys, let us make this saddle make sure I make the right one that's Giga Raptor that's Giga Tyrannosaurus there we go and I don't think I oh yeah I do I have everything I need guys this is just I, I just I'm really at a loss for words right now oh man here we go guys look at the sheer size of this carnivore I'll never forget the day I ran into her oh yeah let's take a look at her stats we haven't looked at her stats yet 18,280 health 400 stamina <laughs> not that great on stamina 150 melee? Ooh. Guys, tell me, is that bad for uh, this Giga? Are these stats, like, mm, not so great? Uh, leave me a comment below. What? I'm not going to put any points into anything right now. I'm going to let you guys tell me because uh, this is the highest, most powerful dinosaur next to the Prontosaurus I've ever tamed. And uh, I'm not quite sure what to do with these stats. So if you guys would, let me know. Uh, for those of you that have trained a uh, Giga before or know of it, uh, what do you recommend I should do this? All right, guys, the time has come. It's time to saddle up. Oh, achievement. Giga rag. You rode the back of a... Oh. I got an achievement, guys. Oh my gosh. Look at look at next to the Bronto. Holy cow. Let's back up the bus. Because this bus takes some wide turns. Okay. Watch out, Freedom. Sorry. Didn't mean to step up your fellas. Okay. All right, guys. Okay, hang on. I got to close my gate. Ride down its tail. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, man. Just. I'm just taking this in, guys. I'm just taking this in. Those colors are pretty, pretty cool. Holy cow. 
Giga, 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 no tos, or oh man, I gotta figure out how to pronounce this. <laughs> oh, how's it stamina for running? Okay, let's see what kind of damage we do. You know, I almost think it was faster when it was just following me. Oh, it's out of stamina already. He runs out of stamina. She runs out of stamina real fast. Oh, boy. Uh, tree was in the way. Let's see if I can one-shot. Yep. I one-shot it. Oh, my goodness. One shot it. Holy cow. Alright, what do we have up here? What is this? I have no idea what that is. Uh, Stego. What level Stego is this? 55. I'm definitely going to have to put <gasps> a Giga Raptor, guys, guys, it's the baby in the nest. The baby is in the nest. <gasps> a Giga Raptor, guys. Why am I stuck on this branch? All right, guys. Uh, yeah, a Giga Raptor. We've been, we've been trying to get a Giga Raptor for so long. Oh my goodness. Drop. 85 prime meats. I'm so conflicted. I want to spend some points. I really think I need to spend some points in stamina because she runs out of stamina really fast. Uh, her stamina is not that great. Uh, let me put one point into stamina and see how far it goes. That was not good. That was not good. I spent two points and uh, and uh, I only got 10 points of stamina. What level are you? Level 10. Guys, this uh this completely changes my game plan for the very next episode. Uh, for the next episode, I was going to make my way back to... I was going to make my way back to our tree base and then come back and tackle a cave. But now we have a Giga Raptor with the baby still in the nest. <laughs> goodness this thing is just just breathtaking guys all right guys i'm gonna take her back to the base help me figure out a name for her if you guys would throw a bunch of suggestions in the box uh if i like it i'm gonna say if i like it i'll choose it i kind of all right let, let me give you guys i i'm kind of thinking of a name right now but i'm not i'm not sold on it um just from the sound of her walking, I'm kind of leaning toward Thunder Thighs. What do you guys think? 
Thunder thighs. Those are some massive thighs, dude. Look at them things. Uh, let me know in the comments below if you guys like thunder thighs or if you have a better suggestion. Uh, I'll be right back. All right, guys, I think this ending deserves a photo mode ending. What do you guys think? Oh, man, this has been just what an adventure. Oh, look at this. Just look at her. Oh, I am going to be doing some damage with her. What do you guys think? Does she look like Thunder Thighs? Or uh, give me a name suggestion. And uh, thank you guys for tuning in. I really appreciate I can't say it enough, man. You guys are the best. Uh, I, I really, I, I'm so blessed to have all of you guys commenting and sharing with me in the comments. It means a lot. And uh, thank you for your likes and your subscribes. Uh, it's just, it's, I'm getting so close to 500, guys. Uh, my dream is to get to 1,000 subs. And, uh, and I just hope you guys really enjoy these episodes. And, and until next time, guys, from the deepest parts of my heart and from Thunder Thighs's lips, <laughs> thank you. Thank you, guys, for this photo moment. Let's go ahead and take the screenshot. There it is. Screenshot taken. And until next time, guys, bye.